All right, come on. I've got some shelves I want you to have a look at. Right. There you go, Rita. She has a malign influence. What? A malign influence. Oh, we're back on Isabella now. They were up all night playing games. Wouldn't that be incest? Not them sort of games. But maybe, perhaps. Who knows? But as a relative, she's a galaxy away. I should hope so and all. Card games. Bisotti or something. He had bags under his eyes. She was complaining about the coffee the other day. Said it tasted like dishwater. Well, she probably thinks they've got a monopoly on it. Italy. And where does coffee come from? Fresh goes. Brazil, Colombia, places like that. You know, Kenya, that's another place. Oh, so it's not even from Italy? I bet we had coffee shops in this country when Queen Elizabeth was alive. Well, that's not going too far back, is it? The first? Oh. <gasps> oh, my God. Speak of the devil, literally. Ciao. Thought you didn't like our coffee? I like your tea. <laughs> Anything for you? No, thank you. Pot, is it? Very kind. May I? Must you? I wanted to speak to you about Brian. He's exhausted all the time. And who's to blame for that? He keeps wanting to go to bed early. I wonder why. I'll tell you why. So he can be up with the cockerel. Like he was this morning. He needs a younger assistant. Someone he can rely on. Is that right? You're too old to work in a shop. Are you after my position? Me? Mm. <laughs> Absolutely no. <laughs> well, I'll tell you, he tries to get to bed early to avoid your overbearing company. I'm sorry? As for the shop, I keep it open single-handedly. So now maybe you can relay a message to him from me. I'd be glad to. I quit. And what's that in Italian? How many gravy boats does one person 